But I mean, we make everything a competition, you know, <laughs> to the point where, you know, competing for grades, competing for, you know, playing time, all those other types of things. So yeah, she comes from a very healthy, competitive <laughs> background. I'm Logan Parks, 2025 outside hitter, setter from Overland Park, Kansas. I think volleyball, she took to you quite a bit. Um, and I think it just, it matches up with her personality. Mm -hmm. I started playing volleyball because of my mom being in and out of the gym um, and just seeing her and being in that environment. And I liked the energy and everything around it. I coached high school when she was six months old. So she was with me in the carrier from that point on. Yeah. Um, so just being in the gym, I think it, it becomes kind of kind of an addiction, kind of a, I need to be in the gym. But when colleges started showing interest, she was like, oh, am I that good, really? I think when I was around 14, when I started seeing college coaches come around courts and people coming around to watch and stuff like that, that was when I really noticed that this was starting to be something for me. I think I knew that it was something that I wanted to do past high school and as a future, um, but also just, again, my mom staying in it and being a coach, all my friends around me doing it, and me wanting to continue to do that in the future. I would say that I am just a very level-headed person. I don't get super hype. I don't get, like, pissed off or anything. I'm just kind of there. I think I kind of balance out everything, is what I would say. Very chill. She's, her demeanor is very balanced, which is really good. But if it's needed and there's some competition that needs to happen, then she has that little bit of an edge, you know, that she can use. I just think that the mental part of volleyball has helped me with other things outside of volleyball as well. And just being able to um, push through things that are difficult and stuff like that. So who in your family do you look up to and why? I would say my brother, just because of his mental side of the game and he's humble, but is still very competitive and um, energetic about everything. I would just say, just seeing him and his process of learning how to take the mental side and the physical side and putting it into his game and seeing that, I think has helped me not have to necessarily figure it out myself from the start. During COVID was kind of the time that I started figuring out Everybody who could be getting better at that time, that time that was kind of taken off and wanting to come out of that and be better than what I, what I was before, better than anybody else. College is really what I want to do in the future. So we started um, listing colleges and colleges that have contacted me um, and kind of marking down and saying colleges that I possibly want to go to in the future. Kentucky, for one, because of their like family-oriented um, culture there. I liked that. Um, Louisville also, because of how the players interacted um, with the coaches and with each other. Um, and then Nebraska, because of their competitiveness. I am a little bit nervous, but I also think that it's um, exciting that that's going to get to be the next step for me. and. I'm gonna to get to know kind of where my future is gonna start. Well, I always start with a little bit of nerves of every game, I think, just because I wanna do good, I guess. Um, but on the court, I think I, just the competitiveness and the adrenaline rush is what pumps me up to, to play. I'm not necessarily like a vocal leader, but just uh, trying to do my best the whole time and um, pushing people that way. Yeah, I think that when I'm when I'm playing volleyball, it's always a everything else kind of erases at the time, and I'm just playing volleyball. I'm Logan Perks, and now you know my name.